Hello guys, welcome to one of you. Today I am going to tell you about six new features of Cyanogen Mode 13, that is CM13. For that, the first feature is multi-window feature. First, go to settings, then go to about phone. Click seven to eight times on build number to enable developer options. Then go back and go in developer options. Slide down, you will see a option name as multi-window option. Enable it. After enabling it, go back. Now you can use your multi-window option as I'm showing you. You can use two windows at a time very fluently. As I'm showing you, I'm using setting and MX player at the same time as you can see now. So the second feature is that you can quickly search your apps. For that, you just have to hold the menu drawer. You just have to hold it like this. And you can easily type application name and search it. For instance, now I'm going to search ES File Explorer. You can open it with ease. The third feature is gesture control. You can unlock different kind of application by using gestures. For that, you just have to go to settings, then swipe down a little. You can see gestures. Now click on it. After clicking on it, you have to enable camera, music and flashlight, all of them. So just enable camera, music, flashlight. After enabling all of them, you can see that there's written draw C to activate camera. So now to use this feature, first you have to lock your phone. After locking your phone, you have to do the gesture C. Now you can see that the camera has turned on. And guys, that's how you can use this feature. The fourth feature is that you can choose different colors for different application notification. For that, you have to go to settings, then go up and select on display and lights, slide down and click on notification light. Either you can choose colors automatically or you can choose manually. As you can see, there's a lot of colors here. You can choose and that's how you can use this feature. The fifth feature is that you can hide your status bar icon. For that you have to go to settings, then swipe down and select on status bar. Then click on status bar icons. As you can see here are a lot of options. So on the top you can see that there is icon of alarm i'm gonna switch it off now it's invisible now turn it off it's visible that's how you can use this feature the sixth one is that you can give manually permissions to different apps to do that you have to go to settings then you have to go to apps now you can go to any apps for instance es file explorer then permission you can allow or deny permission of any application except it's a system one. 